Tonight, Beaumont city leaders are laying the groundwork to build a more robust downtown area. The city hosted its first ever downtown focus vision and growth meeting. Leaders shared their ideas and took suggestions from community members as well. The city is standing firm on its plans to build a river walk and downtown hotel and convention center, and they explained exactly how it would all be paid for. Tonight, 12 News reporter Ebony Coleman attended the meeting. She joins us live from downtown with new details. Hey, Ebony. That's right, Brenda. The city has big plans for downtown, including a river walk that will connect from the Lakes District here to the Nature's River. But tonight, residents got to see the big picture and ask questions of their own. I understand that you know money is always an issue, but um, that's an issue with everything, so it can't be an excuse. Alan Higgins loves Beaumont. It's a place he calls home and says he wants to see it thrive. We come downtown uh, as much as we can. Uh, museums are down here, uh, the Civic Center, obviously, and um, the few restaurants that are here. It's one of the reasons he attended the city's recent downtown focus vision and growth meeting. Many people have seen this in steps, but it's a chance for them to be able to ask questions, specific questions, and also hear of the total scope. Beaumont Mayor Roy West says they're banking on a key attraction to build up downtown, the water. Mayor West says they're making progress to add a river walk and a hotel and convention center. Last week, uh, our request for proposals, that closed on the 26th, and we did have two proposals presented. So uh, later this month, uh, there'll be that is being reviewed currently by the staff. The city wants public and private investments to pay for the hotel, but the Riverwalk would take some time. Things take time in a city, unlike in a business where you may have two or three people making decisions. A Riverwalk would cost $114 million and would be paid for through funds generated by the newly implemented tax increment reinvestment zone. Ultimately, every investment being made for the people of Beaumont. Small shops, uh, small restaurants, uh, just kind of more of a uh, family atmosphere downtown. There are also plans for a new city hall and a new police headquarters as a part of the Vision 2035. I'm live in Beaumont, Ebony Coleman, 12 News.